Hey, Justin Monk here with uh, the Money Maven Project. Um, if you've been following me at all, you've I, you've seen me talk about setting goals for 2021, getting an early start on them. We're like, whatever, a few days away from the first of the year. So if you haven't started on them, probably too late. You're going to be rushing them. You're not going to be able to put enough thought into them. So hopefully you, uh, you've you been putting some thought into them. And, and uh, one thing I wanted to talk about is um, as you set these goals, probably my number one tip is to set them just huge goals, like ridiculously big goals. Because what I found is that when you set big goals, you goals that are on another level, your mind starts to operate at another level. If you are currently making $125,000 and you set a goal to make $135,000, it it's not enough to motivate you. It's not enough to change the way you think about earning money and where you can and looking for opportunities to make more money it's just not enough so if you take that hundred twenty five thousand dollar income and you say well how do i make five hundred thousand or a million dollars and regardless of whether that goal is possible or not um you all of a sudden your brain starts to think at another level so you your brain starts to compute okay well what if like what if we had to make a million dollars or five hundred thousand dollars this year or whatever your goal is whether it's health you know spiritual family stuff like just set big ridiculous goals and your mind will start to operate and think at a different level that's probably the biggest thing that i can say probably the biggest mistake people make is just not making not setting big enough goals uh one of my biggest mistakes early on in my life was you know i had a certain number i wanted to make income wise by the time i was 30 and I set the goal, guess what, I hit it. And now I'm looking back, I'm like, man, it should have been 10 times or five times what it was. And I probably still would have hit it and I would be way farther along the path um, if, if I would have hit a bigger goal at 30. Um, and so my point is, is that if you set those bigger goals, your mind will start to operate and think differently, looking for avenues of how to accomplish those difficult goals. Um, and, and for, for many of you, you may know that I'm a big fan of Grant Cardone. So the 10X rule is a big, big influence in my life. And I definitely recommend that book, The 10X Rule by Grant Cardone. It helps you to start think at 10X, thinking at 10X levels, setting bigger goals, bigger targets. And one thing you got to keep in mind, oh, there's my cat. Uh, one thing you got to keep in mind is that Grant even admits this. He doesn't hit most of his goals. Most of the targets they don't hit as a company. And, uh, but if you look at what Grant Cardone has accomplished, he's accomplished a lot. And that's due to some of his, you know, his huge goals, his big goals and, uh, the way he thinks. So I just recommend take your goals, whatever you wrote down for 2021 and multiply them by five, six, seven, ten. 10, it'd be the 10 X rule. Multiply it by 10 and then say, all right, all right, if it was life or death that I hit this goal, how would we do it? what would we do what would it take you know write those goals down initially not worrying about the mechanics and not worrying about the how you're going to get there but just write them down and then figure it out later just figure it out start to brainstorm okay what would it take what would it take you know if we life or death we had to hit this goal what would we do and that'll change the level that you operate at and the level you think at good luck out there